aimlessly. He said he was hold okay. On, hold on. We asked him if he'd been Ashley, attended to. Can because Pat Dawson, who is not okay. far from you, is being asked to move. All right, Tom. We have just, Tom. We've just been told we're being evacuated. You can see all the emergency workers walking north on the West Side Highway in New York. We've been told by firefighters here that there is a report of a bomb in this building. This is a school, a high school, right here. And as you can see, they're moving everybody away from this building. They've said that there's a bomb in the building. They are evacuating us north now. That is according to firefighters on the scene, and we're going to move out of here right now just to keep ourselves safe. So we're going to start walking north ourselves. But that's what we're being told by New York City firefighters here, that there were reports of a bomb in that high school right there. It's called Stuyvesant High School. And so we are walking north to get out of the way. You can see just to my left here, these are the, even the ambulances which were down there are being moved north. The firefighters are being moved north. Everybody is being moved north. We're being asked by the police now to go north and get out of the way. Uh, is it, officer, do you have any idea of what the problem is? There's a report is? of a secondary device possibly in the area of this school, so they're going to move everybody back as a precaution. A secondary device meaning a bomb? Possibly. Okay, and where did that report come from? Was it, yeah, it called came, in? It came, came in over, uh, over our radios, and it's reported through our supervisors on down, so we're pulling everybody back. And that's in the Stuyvesant High School right there? Yes. Okay, thank you very much, Officer McQuaid. That's Officer McQuaid of New York City Emergency Service. I'm sorry, what's it? We are going to take it back here at CNBC. Bill Griffith along with Sue Herrera. A few more